Preparation takes time. Luke chapter 6 and verse 40. A disciple is not about his teacher, but everyone who is perfectly trained will be like his teacher. The Lord Jesus has invited us to be his disciples. And he makes the statement here that the disciple is not greater than his teacher. Meaning, if his master and if his teacher had to go through a certain preparation process, the disciple also will have to go through a similar process of preparation, a process of training. And so Jesus goes on to say, every disciple who's perfectly trained, who goes through that preparation process will become like his teacher or like his master. And this preparation process takes time. If you look at the life of Jesus himself, he waited 30 years before he could start his earthly ministry. Now we could question why he could have started when he was nice and young, early 20s or something. He could have done it earlier, but he waited 30 years until the Father said, it's time for you to launch out and do the assignment I've called you to do. He went through that time of preparation and then he started out at the right time. And Jesus saying, you know, the disciple has to follow the master. You go through a training process. You go through getting perfectly trained so that you can then become like your master. So in the working of God in our lives, he takes us through this period of being trained. He takes us through this period of preparation. God may speak to you well in advance of the kinds of things He wants to do through you, uh, but then He takes you through the preparation process, gets you ready before He can release you into the assignment. And remember, the fulfilling of that assignment itself is a process of a seed time and harvest. There's a process involved even in the carrying out of the assignment. So that is why you and I need endurance. You and I need persistence because preparation takes time. And if we don't persist through the preparation, we will abort our calling. We will abort our destiny. We won't be able to get into the assignment because we're not prepared for the assignment. Stay with God's preparation process and whatever He's dealing with you and whatever He's taking you through, journey with Him and you will be ready for the assignment He has for your life. Let's pray. Father, we ask you that you'll give us the grace, the endurance, the strength we need to grow, go through the preparation so we can be perfectly trained, fully equipped for the assignment you have for our lives. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.